Hello Strutters, even though I, I'm done and even though I don't know what I'm doing, I'm still playing Dinrova Horror Tron. This is Dinrova Horror Tron weekend apparently. This is actually recorded on the 30th of March. But I had all these Burning Tree Emissary videos to upload before that. Okay, here we go. Baba619. Uh, this looks like uh, some lands and I do love lands, so I'm gonna keep that. I think the biggest danger is we don't get lands or we don't get colored mana. And here we have all of that, so... I'm going to keep it. Hope I'm playing against aggro because this hand against control will not be any fun. Uh, that's uh, something aggressive, I guess. Tower into Prism. Remote Isle, which we will cycle so hard. I'm assuming it's Boris Kitty. I hope it's not Boris because then uh, he can't hurt us. I'm gonna cycle this immediately. Looking for some action. Get Condescend, that's not action in any sense. Okay, so now I have, I have two colored mana, and I'm just looking for the mine. Okay, hit me hard, Mr. White Deck. And I bet you can. God, I hope you're mono white. What the hell is that? Okay, nice. Silkbind Fairy. Uh, looks dirty enough. Now I can condescend something, which is what I will do. Way too eagerly, probably. Silpine Fairy used to be played a lot in Pauper. She has two power here. Uh, we'll uh, just counter the Maldrifter. No cards for you. I am surprised to see a Maldrifter. Uh, I'm gonna bottom... Well, Horror! We will actually be able to play Horror. I'm gonna bottom the flicker. Will this do any good for us? We won't be able to cast it until turn seven. No, I guess we bottom that. We look for more card draw. And of course we look for mine. That thing seems pretty good, let's just uh, use it. Check out the yard. We wanted a mine, we didn't find a mine. I guess we're taking teachings. Then at least something happens. And we have horror in the yard. Got to be good. Got five mana. Alchemy is seven to flashback. So we'll just teachings. We are under no pressure. I'm gonna F6 because I'm already a minute behind. Please be um, oh, it's another silk bind fairy. Look at that. That's pretty decent. For a mine. And we can then flashback alchemy. 
Uh, but let's do that at the end of his turn. Or cast teachings if we want something in particular. But what's that? What do we want? Why would alchemy be better? I'm gonna teachings for teachings. These creatures are all so insignificant. That I don't care much about them. <laughs> wow, it's the March of the One Ones. Maybe teachings for... Um, a teachings for Pulse and get uh, Mr. Big out there. Is that correct? Let's try it. Uh, can we cast him? We really can't do that. But now we got three. Right, so we get a green Pulsum Rasa for the horror. And hit Tranquil Cove, I guess. Uh, blue. Black. No. Blue. Black. God, this deck will time out so often, I bet. I guess it's a land. And then he will tap the horror a lot. So that's fun for him. We still have teachings and alchemy, which we probably should use. Oh, of course, with teachings for Flicker. Okay. Yeah, he will declare attackers and then he will tap me. Yeah, with teachings for Flicker, that's the key to everything. Block you. Raise the alarm. What? Oh my god. Uh, I did definitely not uh, expect that. So the Rover Horror dies. And that matters. What's the right order of things here? We need, we have 9, 11, 13, 15 mana. So we should be able to mnemonic wall. That's 5, 11, 14. So mnemonic wall. No, it's not gonna work because they cost extra mana. But we are in no trouble at all. Uh, so I am going Minimonic Wall for Pulse Marasa. Did I forget the uh, Mystical Teachings and Forbidden Alchemy? Maybe I did. So now I have 10 mana. It's one mana too little to do this. So with my 10 mana, I can either alchemy or mystical teachings. And I guess I mystical teachings for flicker and then we settle this. Do I have enough mana to do that and pulse? I think so. Sh 
Chancer, oh, that will help with bouncing your stuff, my friend. Oh, you have a vehicle. So now maybe I don't block with the wall then. Ah, okay. I'll take the pain that I so rightfully have earned. Here is the flashback of teachings for Ghostly Flicker. And then I do this thing. And then it's over, right? Is it over? I don't know. Let's try it. Black blue. Horror. Against one of those. I could just expedition map another tower here. Maybe I need blue mana. More than I need anything else. Flicker those two. Cut back flicker. Get rid of his hand. This is the point where people unnecessarily concede. No! Uh, still got rid of a creature. Yes, please. And I am playing that. And I guess I can't do anything I want. So let's see what he can do. He must kill my guys and he's not going to do that. So I'm just going to take this because it's not too much. And then flicker the chancery. No, we're, we still have to flicker. Ta-da! No! Clever. Now we'll get rid of that thing. Making him discard a card. Uh, still feels pretty good. We still have Forbidden Alchemy. So let's look at the prism. Uh, let's get another tower, I guess. Maybe we even get an island here. Let's randomly get an island. Uh, Maldrifter. <laughs> um, yeah, let's play that too. He can't kill us in one turn, so... For Ghostly Flicker. And that should be the game. Yeah, I'll take your four damage. Happily.
Or five damage even. Maybe I got too cocky there. No. Okay. Guess the spells will help me. And some artifacts. I didn't feel very threatened. Pulse of Marasa was very powerful. Do what do I take out here? Yeah, it's just oh, everything is win. What do I board out? I feel like boarding out the combo all of the time, but that's that's of course pretty bad. I don't think I need three horrors. Maybe I do. So maybe grudge is too much. I won grudge against vehicles. Maybe it's prohibit actually. Because it's not going to counter Maldrifters. Everything is so good. <laughs> oh, what do I, I don't know what to take out. I'm going to go with one Dispel. I don't think this will be determined by counter wars. Now I'm going to cut Dispel all the way. And play tap out control here. Because he's trying to be tempo control and you just can't tempo control this without Delvers. Maybe he has them, but he felt very slow compared to Delver deck. To the cold deck. So ask him for that. Uh, okay, this looks amazing. Holdouts. Uh, okay. Uh, I'm gonna keep this. Very innovative deck. Uh, so, not giving up the dream of Tron. I'm gonna go for Prism turn two. Uh, okay, a grizzly bear that gains life. Gotta love it. Okay, we have colored mana. I'm glad I didn't bring in another moment space. Protection from black. Very nice. Can he do it to any permanent? No, just the creatures. And I'm just gonna bounce his land, so that doesn't really matter much. I guess I play Seagate Oracle here. Just looking for the tower. That is not tower. I think I take teachings here. But the mine allows me to play four drop next turn, but without, no, I'm gonna take teachings. You can gain as many life as you want. I don't think that is a factor even. Seagate Oracle, oh, it's Battle Screech. Well, Electric will kick some butt here. Battle Screech is of course very powerful. But I do have my moment's piece to hide behind. So I am happy like this. I wonder if he does something with... If he has some boosting card. I'll block and moment's piece if he pumps. I 
Can't really do much else. Uh, oh my god. Glad I bought in Elk's Trickery. So now I can play Muldrifter. And discard some cards. Maybe this is where I just evoke the Muldrifter and then get it back with Pulse later. Still got to discard some cards, so... Uh, no, let's just play it. Well, uh, sweet cards to discard. Is those Are those the cards I want to discard? Probably not. Now a massive pump. Can it be lethal? 3, 3, 50, can be lethal, right? Yes, die to massive pump here. You are allowed to kill Seagate Oracle if you want to. Now let's keep it cool. I moments peace. I uh, do mystical teachings. I do forbidden alchemy. That's it. I have all the possibilities. I don't need to allow a successful attack again. I can. Where's the value? Oh, he just bounce a land. He's Din Rova horroring himself. Almost. Yeah. Look at that. So what do I do now? I guess I can afford an alchemy here. Yeah, I'll take uh, Maldrifter. And play it next turn because I am hiding behind. No, I have so much mana. So I have no need to hide. And that thing can cast Moments Peace, so. Just go ahead and resolve another Maldrifter. Wow. And I'm gonna discard the land. Three mana can't have fun. There's gonna not gonna be an attack, right? I can pulse a Marassa. An island? No, I can't. But here they come. Okay, so we block and kill that guy. He seems dangerous. And we block that guy. How much do we take then? Six. Seems decent. Uh, there is Rally. So now we take more. And that is why we... Moon's piece. We're getting counterspelled! Are we then dead? We are gonna miss those negates, but we are not dead! Which is good, because being dead sucks. I'm gonna have to play fast now, because we're reaching the end of the 16 first minutes. Uh, I'm gonna pulse a Marassa. 
a mull drifter. Keep up two movements pieces. I need six mana for that. So these lands, I have two lands to play with. That's not gonna get me anywhere. Uh, but it could get me a forbidden alchemy, so I am done here. I really need to use Forbidden Alchemy. Okay, so we Moments Peace. I'm done with Forbidden Alchemy for Electricery. Forbidden Alchemy. Now we know why it's forbidden. God. Take the tower, I guess. Uh, we'll have teachings for electric here, right? Does that work? Two, three, four colored mana. I guess that works. And we play it. Yeah, that looks better. And then we horror the chancery, I think. Or we can just, we can wall for electricity, right? Killing those two guys. God, I'm slow. That didn't work. So now we still have five mana, which we cannot do anything with. Which is kind of embarrassing. We can invoke a Mulrifter and do we do that? Nah. Better to have moments piece up, right? Got teachings, got forbidden alchemy in the graveyard. Everything is on our side. It's pretty much just the clock that matters. Horror and Chancery will be so much fun. This is six damage. And I guess we can't take that. Got one moment's piece, so... Let's take it. Two cards in hand for him. Curse of the Bloody Tome. I didn't expect that, but uh, it's not like we can do a whole lot about it. It will put more interesting stuff in my yard. Um, Horror of the Land seems like they have. He has two, two flyers. So Horror of the Silkbound Fairy, step one. I am getting stressed by, so go away, stupid fairy, uh, play this, I guess, and just resolve Mulrifters, I just get one.
we can teachings for uh, can teachings for uh, brutal ghostly flicker right we have one left but this is it for the time being <laughs> we are fairly close to dead we will teachings for ghostly flicker and then we go off Well, if he has that pump spell, he wins. Place Sky Fisher. Zero value. Didn't get my flicker, no. So, uh, teachings for ton of mana. Ghostly flicker. Uh, flicker. Horror maldrifter. Return. Kurskai Fisher. Throw some cards. Oh, there's a moment space. Uh, wall. Get flicker. Yes, please. And flicker. Flicker horror wall for the sky fisher and get back flicker. Yes, and keep up moments, please. Here, yes, and then just flicker everything next time. Yes! Wow. I went way past 60 minutes there. I didn't lose a game, but uh, I was still in danger from the clock. What a duck! Okay, you, you will get another Pope deck tomorrow. I just had this binge on the 30th of March playing this deck. Thank you for watching. I will be looking forward to your feedback so I can adjust the deck for later matches.